Welcome back to The Drill. I'm Chris Burnett here with Mark Moore, newly named head strength and conditioning coach for men's basketball. Thanks for being with us, Mark. Mark, you're a hometown guy. Graduate from Riverdale High School. Graduated also here from MTSU in 2009. You went away for a couple of years and now you're back, came back as an assistant, and now you're the newly named head strength and conditioning coach. How does that feel to be from here? Uh, it feels pretty good. You know, it's nice to be in my hometown, my alma mater, you know, so it's, it's nice to be back. Sure, that can be exciting. Now, talk to us a little bit about the difference that you're going to take in the approach for the workouts going from an assistant coach to now as the head coach being your workouts. Well, see, now it's got my name on it. So this is a reflection of me, how the guys work, their work ethic, what they do, how they do it. It's all a reflection of me. As opposed to when I was an assistant, it was somebody else's program. So I still trained him how he wanted them done. But now, now that it's me, it's all how I want it done. Excellent. Coming off last season, you guys are now in the middle of the off-season workouts. Talk to us a little bit about the main focuses that you have as far as areas of opportunity or areas of improvement that you're looking for out of your guys. I I'm, I'm, want to run more of an effort-based program where I want to see the guys work. I'm a believer in it's not what you do, it's how you do it. And it's my, it's my job to present the best program to them that's going to keep them healthy, that's going to get them strong, that's going to get them explosive. And it's their job to give a lot of effort and everything to do with that program. So that's going to be my main focus. I'm going to throw a lot of stuff at them, a lot of things that will give them different benefits in different areas. And my job for them is to attack it and give a lot of effort. You were able to come in in January as an assistant. You were able to be part of a pretty magical run there that led to a berth in the NIT tournament. Coming into this season, what do you see as the biggest challenge for your guys to be able to compete at that same level or higher going into next year? Well, prior to last year, I think the guys had a chip on their shoulder. They were, they were hungry. They wanted it. And after being successful this past season, I want to make sure that hunger and that chip's still there where they'll still work for it and give everything they have to be successful even more so than they were last year. And on that same note, to kind of wrap things up, any specific expectations that you'll have for your guys from a strength and conditioning perspective going into this season? Just work hard. Hard work pays off. Absolutely. Here in the drill, I'm Chris Burnett. That's all we have for today. Thank you.